Hi friends, uh, today we are going to learn uh, simple environment design in Maya. So first we will uh, take a plane and uh, I am going to increase the subdivision width and height from here about 40 or maybe 50. Then I go to Mash Tools, Sculpting Tools and Sculpt Tools, the shortcut is Control 1. I am going to the settings of Sculpt Tool. I, so here is the brush of uh, Sculpt Tool. I can increase the size of brush uh, from here. I can control the size of brush by pressing B and left click drag. We can also adjust the strength from here of this tool. I am going to sculpt my environment. So be careful when you sculpt the environment. So you can see I am giving the details on my uh, plane. I am creating hills. I am planning to create here some hills and uh, a river like structure here. So by using this brush I pulling my mesh yeah. we can push the mesh also by pressing control and working like that so I'm gonna create here a water body river like structure shape by pressing control push it down camera angle is very important in this exercise So this is the first look of my scene and uh, I am going to create another plane or water body here. Yeah. Let me adjust that, selecting edges and select this edge and shift it back. Now we are going to texture it, texture our environment. So uh, right click and assign new material. Select Lambert. Go to material attributes. Find here color attributes. You may change color from here. But in this case, I don't want to change the color. I want to go to file option and uh, simply pick a fractal. Press 6 to show the texture. So you can see here the fractal is a combination of colors black, white, and gray. So we may adjust here. The settings also, amplitude, threshold, go down and color balance. Color balance, we may change these colors to get our output. So, I am going to change color again first and 
uh, give it a nice texture like this offset also For better result, I have to apply bump mapping also. So right click and uh, material attributes, and go to bump mapping, and take a fractal again. So you can see the bump value is too high. So we may adjust this from here, bump depth value, so 0 0.5, uh, probably 0 0.1. It is looking. Uh, now we apply the texture to water body, select it and uh, right click assign new material, ocean shader, this time we apply ocean shader, so this is our scene. We may add uh, some trees also there by default trees. We may add uh, from here, go to generate and uh, get brush. You can find the trees here, and we may add any tree whichever you want. And, uh, for example, I want to add this tree, tree bear, right click, then apply brush to selected stroke, down, and uh, let me add some trees up there. So guys, this is the environment. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Thanks for watching, guys.